I think it's also important to say that with the scene of all these uh, blue lights here today and all the drama of this, people would be alarmed that it might be something other than what we believe it to be. It is a road traffic collision with multiple fatalities. It's a terrible incident, but we don't believe that there is anything at this juncture that is sinister about the accident. So, uh, so I do beg your pardon, I missed the top of that. Can you just tell me what is the situation now at the scene? Uh, James, the situation just now is we have the road uh, closed off from Ingram Street and Queen Street to uh, George Square. Um, we are currently starting a joint investigation with the Criminal Investigation Department as to what has happened here this afternoon. Uh, what do you know about what happened? At about 2.30 this afternoon, a Glasgow City Council refuse, a bin lorry, was travelling north in Queen Street outside the Gallery of Modern Art when it was in a collision with a pedestrian. The bin lorry then has continued north on Queen Street. It would appear to have gone up uh, the footway and there have been a number of other pedestrians that it has collided with. Over what distance did it travel along the pavement? I would estimate it to be about, um, well, from the point of, of the initial impact to the hotel, about 300 metres. At what speed? I can't say at this stage. Clearly, it's very early days, I know. Uh, there is a suggestion that the driver had lost control, possibly due to ill health. Are there signs, are there signs that that is the case? I can't say for certain what's happened. I can tell you that the driver has also been taken to hospital where he is receiving treatment. For what? I can't say at this stage. Was he ill before the collision? I can't say at this stage. Do you know what caused the initial collision with that initial pedestrian, that first pedestrian? But that's part of the investigation and it will take us uh, some hours to absolutely ascertain that. But for now, it does not look to be uh, either a criminal or deliberate act that has taken place here this afternoon, but we need to have time to fully investigate it.